course, the past 30 years since Dragon Ball games exist, and every game has always had that one problem here. Never forget Broly in the original Budoka games, or Kid Buu in the Tenkaichi series. And let's not forget, the second you lose in Xenoverse, you break out Hit or Super Saiyan Blue Goku and get an easy win. Broken characters have existed all the time over the course of the past 40 years in Dragon Ball games, but I feel like it's always been consistent between a handful of characters. It's always Super Saiyan 2 Team Gohan and Broly. And that's exactly the problem we have to deal with in today's video. Today we're back with some more Fusion World. As you guys know, if you've been playing this game, the green deck is just absolutely free wins. <laughs> if you want to have a, the easiest win of your life, Simply download this game for free. It's on PC, not sponsored, by the way. Download this game for free and just choose the green deck and enjoy the easiest wins you'll ever have in a Dragon Ball game. But you know what? I like to be challenged, so I switched to a yellow deck. You know, apparently yellow is supposed to be a way to balance out the force and allow you to have like a better chance. But man, I still feel like I, I do my best, man. I still be losing. <laughs> I still be losing. I know the new set's coming out, I believe, May 19th, and the, the cards that they've been relieving on social media, on Twitter, have been pretty decent. I, I saw some green support, but there should be more balance when the next set comes out. The problem though is that's still weeks away. Actually, more than a month. We have to deal with green Broly, green Gohan, and even green androids until then. And I don't know if I got what it takes to last that long. I can't even find a match. You know why? Because it looked in the game and said, don't match him with the green, and it found nobody. That's what just happened. All right, we got a match. Is it a green player? I'll be real with you. If I see green, I'm probably just going to bounce. Nah, I'm not I'm not even cap. I see green, I'm out. Oh, Beerus. Yellow versus red? Okay. Alright. I don't think I've seen I think I've seen like two Beerus players, period. What's my hand looking like? Uh great. Keep that hand. Keep that hand. That's a, that's a good hand. That is a fantastic hand. Am I going second? No, I'm not. I'd never go second. I I wish. Alright, we got charge first. Don't make a mistake here and click on the card that you don't wanna uh, do. So I think what we'll do is we'll charge you. We'll play Vegeta. And what Vegeta lets me do is, is we go into skill, we draw a card. You want to be able to draw all the cards that you need, and that's all we can. All right, so the question is, do I care about, about criticals? Because he's going to attack me here in a second. But he also might attack Vegeta because, again, that draw engine is kind of annoying. But if he has Whis, Whis is actually a good counter because you drop Whis, you can activate the skill to just blow up a card or reduce a card by 5,000, in which case... Wrong Whis. That's the... Oh, no. It's the same thing. It's on play. All right. So, I never mind. He gets he gets everything. My opponent gets everything. Um, Sure, man. That's fine. I can't stop it anyways. I don't have enough um cards in my hand. But, yo, these... Uh, Golden Death Beam might be very useful later. What I realized about the yellow deck that I didn't really like is there's not really many cards that clear boards. And I need something that can blow stuff up. At least with this, once we get to, like, early mid-game, they start dropping the... Uh, we drop cards. I can blow it up with, with Golden Death Beam, which is nice. We lost Chilai. Awesome! Why? <laughs> I need that. <sighs> All right, we got. Uh, I will charge that. All right, we're just gonna go ahead and play Zarbon and then draw a card. And we have two options actually. Yeah, we'll do that actually. This is great. This, that was a good card. That, that was a good draw. I'm gonna go ahead and drop Frieza. But if you never played this game. It's very easy to pick up. Anybody can anybody can play it. Uh, let's actually attack. He's not gonna protect us. Let me attack. Let me attack right now, real fast, and see if they'll block this. They shouldn't, right? Yeah, they, they won't. Two criticals fighting each other. Just no you in the video game. Uh, to people who are like thinking about playing this game, picking it up, it's very easy to pick up. I think one of the hardest aspects of learning this game is is resource management. Because a lot of times I find myself playing cards that I shouldn't, and it results in me. Having like way too little cards by like turn three or four. And it's something I've been teaching myself to get better at with the game. But then you have green players who just get infinite cards. They get infinite energy. They get infinite boss cards. And you know, it's just life is on easy mode. But we're not there. We're not there. I'm never playing that deck. Unless it becomes more balanced in the future, which obviously it will at some point. All right, we got another Whis. So he's going to blow up my, um, my Zarbon, which is fine. And he's going to... Okay, go to six energy. No, that's the other one. That's the draw. That's the draw, Roshi. And then just go for a crit. Uh, I think that's fine. That's perfectly okay. He only has four cards in hand. So, again, that part is important. Card management in hand is, like, one of the most uh, important aspects to learn in, in this game. And I don't know if... I, I think red decks play like this at this speed. At, at, right now is when they should only have about four cards. Unless they, like, you know, being way more patient and just waiting for the future. All right. And now... Uh, Golden Frieza. I already charged one. I think I have to charge this. I can't use it yet. Yeah, we'll just, we'll just go ahead and charge it for now. So, I will attack. 
I will attack. I feel like he's got to take this too. He could use one of these. He didn't. Okay. And we took away their... What, what did he lose? Frost. Frost is a great card to deal with. And I guess I'll just drop my blocker. Field. That's it. That's really it. All right. We just want to go ahead and end. A lot of times with, with the card game too, you also got to be more patient and just know when not to attack. Because whenever you attack a leader, they draw a card for taking damage. Ooh! Sometimes my opponent is just better. Sometimes the opponent is just way better. This is one of those cases. Damn! That's annoying. What did we just lose? We lost the draw Vegeta. That sucks. Uh, I think I have to charge. I'll charge this. I'll charge this. Because now... Well, actually, let's attack first. And we're getting, we got to be getting to, to the point where they're going to stop uh, taking these hits. Right? Surely. No, he's taking this. All right. Ooh. Uh, now I'm just going to drop my blocker. I'm not going to attack with this. I'm going to just end. So what I can do, when, when I awaken, I can actually take my uh, cards. And after I play them, I can go back to active mode with them. And once I transform, I'll be able to do that. So I can do like multiple attacks and stuff like that. I think I'm going to start blasting these uh, Frieza cards too next turn. Actually, I kind of hope that he plays Frost here in a second, which I feel like he has in his hand. Oh, dude, he's got... Uh, he lost both of his Supreme Kai's already. This card's annoying. Okay, so he's going to go minus 5,000. Going after my... Uh, my... Uh, my cooler. And we are going to block... Because now he has, to, he has to... Hold on, we can also go into rest mode, right? Oh, no, you can just KO a car off a two, two or less. I guess we'll get rid of this. Get out of here! So now he has to combo to stop this. Oh, no, he's just going, he's just going to go for it. Okay. That means his hand is probably bad. Why did you just combo the, the Whis in the field? That's why. You were going for that play. Okay, I got... I, I see what you're doing. I see what you're doing. Um, but dude, this doesn't do anything. Okay, he's just trying he's just trying to kill my bro. He wants that card dead. <laughs> so he's at 45,000, right? By the way, someone pointed out to me that you don't have to do the math. If you click the card, it shows you what the power is down here. So I would get to 25,000 here. So this doesn't do anything. So we're just gonna go ahead and end here. <gasps> he's gone! Alright, and what we what we draw here? Uh not that great. I guess I'll charge this. All right, I need to draw the out. So I'm going to go ahead and attack with Cooler first. He's going to let this go through so he can awaken here in a second. Uh, and that's all I can really do. Yeah, unfortunately, that's all we can do here. And we just got to end uh, with no plays. That, that kind of sucks. I only have three extra cards in this deck. And it's it's two it's um two of these. And then one of these. And of course, I drew all three back to back. In a 50, in a 50 card deck. Right, so he's gonna awaken again. The, the thing about normal decks that aren't green here, it can't really do a lot here. So you can drop technically uh, five energy Beerus. He's gonna blow that up. That, that's one of the uh, abilities that, that he gets. But the question is, is we start attacking me? So that's gonna be a critical. Which means I drop a card. What we what we lose here? Let's find out. And I will flip here. Not that it matters, but I get to draw at least. Guldo's crazy, by the way. Guldo is so annoying. Uh, yeah, you can hit me. I would like to start drawing here. You have two, what, two cards in hand, right? Yeah, okay. Three cards in hand. Ooh, we get the play. Another, bro, why do I draw like this? Who shuffled my deck? Who shuffled my deck? I need to know. I need, I just want to, I just, I just want to talk. I just want to talk. I just want to talk. All right, we'll, we'll drop one of you. Uh, I will attack with you just for purposes of drawing. Ooh, that's a great card. Probably going to take this so they can get a draw. Yeah. So what I can do here, I can do a lot. If I drop this, this is going to be annoying. I can attack. They're probably going to let this go through. Oh, they're going to they're gonna stop that. Okay. You realize you're still taking damage here. <laughs> you're still taking damage here. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and drop Guldo on the field. And this is why Guldo's obnoxious. Skill! You don't get to play Gohan next turn. And we are going to discard a card. Probably drop you. 
No, I need I need defense. Uh, we'll drop we'll drop. This. I say we drop a uh, golden beam right now because it won't be that useful. Because we're in a point where we're at, we're in like the three energy range. We're gonna put uh, Frieza back into attack mode so we can attack one more time. All right. Ooh. And uh, that's it. Should I have done that? I feel like I shouldn't have done that because he's at so he can't switch go on to attack mode this this turn. He can attack me with Beerus, and if he drew any other cards, so he can blow up a ghoul, that's fine. But if he has, like, a double strike or something, I just lose. Do I block this? I'm, I'm going to block this only because I I got to be careful of what happens next. If he, dro if he drops a double strike, that will cost five energy. Okay, so one energy. I'm going to draw a card, which is important for him for next turn. There, there's the Goku. Okay. So what he can do is he can attack into into Frieza. Why, why are you boosting? I'm not gonna protect it. I'm not protecting it. I'm not. I'm not protecting him. Absolutely not. Yeah, and then I do a life damage. Ooh. Didn't want to draw that next turn. So that's good. All right now. Ooh. I'm gonna just charge this. Uh. Do I just attack? Activate this to boost myself. Yes. And then. Oh, he's gone! I was like, what happened? <laughs> I was gonna say, because I can also use Guldo and Banana, but you'll give me an extra 10,000. I would have been at 60,000 damage. This game is so much more fun! When you're not dealing against green, man. I'm about to queue into the next game. It's going to be green. I guarantee it. I, I just know it. I just know it. I want you all to know, I like this deck so much that I immediately had it made IRL. It was a lot of fun. It's a lot of fun. I got my Frieza's and everything. It's a very enjoyable deck. Who are we playing against? I didn't see. Cooler? Frieza? Yo, did we enter? Did we enter this like weird Twilight Zone where... Ooh. Uh, let's change. Did we enter this weird Twilight Zone where people got tired of playing green or all... What is this? What is this mulligan? I can't play any of this. Well, at least I got to go second. Did we enter this weird Twilight Zone where everybody's like tired of green or are all green players in God rank? Like what happened? What happened here? I mean, I ain't gonna complain. All right, uh, throw. Let's charge you. We're not gonna play anything. I'm just gonna attack. We're just going to attack and go for the critical here. Right, what did I drop? Ooh, that's a pretty good card to drop. And that that's it. We didn't get our any right one energy cards. Where are my Vegetas? Where's my Zarbons? I have a lot of plus one or one drop energy cards in, in, in this deck. Where are they at? I'll shuffle twice and draw twice and I don't have anything. They charged this? Why did you charge this? That had to be an accident. I feel like that was an accident. That was definitely an accident. Yeah, you can attack me. Draw. Ooh, nice. Bro, it's all high energy cards. What is happening right now? I don't think I've ever lost this game because I bricked. That's six now. I got a blocker right here. It'd be nice. Golden death beam here. Didn't draw that. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll just charge this one now. I'll play this. Okay, so I, we, that, that didn't do anything for me. I'm going to go attack and just force him to play his blocker. Because we're, we're going to enter the zone where... Oh, he's letting that go through. Okay. Or maybe he just wants to get the four energy fast. Again, if you're new to this, when you get the four energy or less, you can transform. You can awaken. And that's when the game gets actually pretty crazy. Uh, That's all we're going to do. We're going to keep saving our extra energy until the time is right. Probably next turn, actually. I, I might just play my full power Frieza. No, not yet. Not yet. Because the thing about this card is it can't go into active mode. Ooh, double blocker. Okay. Are you just stacking up? Fair. I would love to draw into my... Now it gets kind of crazy. This is what Freeze's ability is. It's low-key better than his. Uh, once per turn at the end. Uh, Yeah, I guess hit me. Once per turn... You got to ha take two of your Frieza clan cards and set them into half. Basically, yeah, attack mode. There we go. Now we're getting cards that I, I, I need to see. Okay. This Frieza is obnoxious. And then attack. I kind of want to block this, to be honest. You know what? I want to block it with... I'm going to block it with Kui. 
He's gonna he's probably gonna attack with the second one here in a second as well. And I'll do my use my second Kui. I, I'm I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I like Kui, but Kui's not that great. Kui uh switches the card to rest mode after it dies. Like I don't really need it, but there's only so many cards you can play right now with every single deck. Alright. Uh banana's good. Banana's very good actually. I wanna go ahead and charge this. I think we'll play this. I'm gonna activate the ability to draw. Ooh, pretty good. Also very annoying. I think I'm gonna go ahead and drop this. And I'm gonna do the exact same shit. I'm gonna set this card into rest mode. And I'm just gonna attack. We're gonna get to the point where he's gonna stop blocking. You, you, you gotta stop blocking here. No blocking? He's gonna combo though, right? Surely. Don't get the three energy. Don't get the three energy now. Okay, there we go. I wanted that card gone, so that worked out. That worked out. And oh, I can just do this. I can just attack his uh, blocker and then force him to activate any of his cards as well. Combo his cards. Okay, that's fair. It's a good trade. Uh, and now I'm gonna drop. I'm gonna use my energy. It's, it's time. What banana does is at the end of the turn I can switch my cards into. Uh, oh, he's not. A, he's not a. Uh, oh, he's a cool little squadron. That's fine. That's fine. Damn! Banana lets you take Frieza army cards and set them into active mode at the end. Oh, that would've been great. But at least uh, Vegeta doesn't die, and Vegeta's useful. Okay, so it's four cards versus what they have, like, uh, six. Pretty fair. But I did, I did have to waste my extra energy there. I think that's okay. Right? No, we'll just do this. We'll, we'll, we'll just we'll, we'll combo this, because then he's going to be forced to attack again. He's going to attack with one of these. And then it's going to have to go into rest mode here. You want to block this? Yeah, I'll block with you. I'll block with you. And, I, I, and then I'll let him attack with the last one. So he's smart not letting me get my energy to, to four. Yeah, you, you, you can die now. That's fine. All right, will you attack me, though, with anything else? Can you play another card? And Vegeta's great because I get to draw. Otherwise, Vegeta will be dead right now. Hey, I'm going to do the same play here. Are you going to attack me, though? I feel like he should. Might as well. No, he's not. Okay. Interesting. Uh, we are going to charge Banana Man. I'm gonna do this and draw another card. Uh, do I care about this? I don't think I do. Let's just go into attack. He's gonna have to start blocking with, with his blockers. Oh, no, he's still going through. Okay. Right, I'm just gonna do. I'm just gonna do cooler. Because when this happens, I can actually put this to rest. Actually, and then it KOs if it's two energy or less. I really wish you could use cooler. Okay, fair. I wish you could use cooler to uh, go into attack active mode with Banana Man here, but you can't. But. Why? Vegeta going to attack mode. Or active mode. I mean, it's still good, because again, I get to draw, and I really need that right now, because they're at six cards in hand. They're going to go to five here in a second. So five versus three. We're getting to the point where Golden Frieza will completely turn the entire game around, so that's what I got to be careful about. Okay. They have five cards in hand now. And he's attacking. Why would I? Can I protect? I can't protect. I No, I cannot protect. If I go into, nah, he's gotta die. He's gotta die. Okay, it's fair. He's got a big beam, in my opinion, but sure. And I really, finally, I was like, I need him to attack me. <laughs> Please attack me. Yes, I'll take, I'll gladly I'll take that. Okay, we got Naze. Naze is good. Wish I had Naze earlier, though, because I would have been closer to four energy, but it is what it is. This is gonna get very, very close here. Ooh, okay. We, we got, this is actually kind of nasty if you think about it. Because they both are going to go into active mode here in a second. This is bad. Double full power Frieza is nasty. Oh, and my golden death beams won't, won't do anything if I draw them, draw into them. Um, This one. I'll just charge this one now. I think what I got to do. Oh, yeah. We'll flip first. Oh, wait a minute. I think I could win here. 
right? No, no, no. Go Golden Freeze is, is a level 5. This is only level 4 or, or less. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So if I drop this attack, if I drop this, they'll they'll get double strike. But I shouldn't do that. That would be smart. I think the smart thing to do will be to drop this and attack. You know what? Let's draw another card. That's fine. He'll probably block this with a card in hand. Okay. That went through. Interesting. So, if I drop Frieza now, and I attack with Frieza... Oh, wait. I get to draw again. I forgot. Banana Man. Okay. So, if I drop Frieza... Let's go for it. You know what? I'm gonna trust. I'm gonna trust my gut. I'm gonna trust my gut. I'm just gonna attack with Frieza for double strike here, and I will use you and Banana Man for combo. We're talking about fifty thousand damage here. He's gonna have to use a lot of cards to stop this. Oh, he's got super combos. Okay, so Chilai. You still need. You still need more. You still need more. Okay, Udo. Here, bro. I think they have to do that. I, that. You know what? That was a good trade. That was a good trade. That was a great trade. Uh, This I can't do anything with because this is only level 4 or less. So I think we just end. Imagine if you, you could use Cooler to put this into attack. Well, that would be so broken. Yeah, I think we just end here. And then put this into attack mode. All right. So next turn, he can basically use both of these 40,000 beat sticks to just take a lot of my life. But that's why I didn't like go all in and I'm using like I'm saving my hand carefully here. By the way, if this is green, they will probably have like nine energy by now. Nine energy with like three boss cards in the field. This is why I like, play normal decks, but like green just ruins the game to be honest. Okay, they're gonna attack. I think we let this go through. Nah, no, we don't. We don't have to. We can just do this. We can just do that. <laughs> Nice death beam. Do they make it for men? Now, the card that screws me here the most will be Golden Frieza, which I assume they drew into by this point. They, they gotta have. Most of these decks usually run like three or four copies, so surely they drew into Golden Frieza here. Okay. Chilai would not get me there. Well, what I could do is... You know what? Let this... I'm gonna combo this. And I'll combo Naze. Hear me out. The reason why... Is because I need to live past Golden Frieza. I, I'm, 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 I'm assuming that they have Golden Frieza in their hand. Uh, this will not do it. This will not do it, will it? I think I have to do this, that, and this. Okay. Now, if Golden Frieza comes out and I get the double strike, I'm still alive. Let's see what happens. This, this is gonna be the final round. Okay. They don't have it yet. They don't have it yet. They have four cards in hand, too. There he is. I knew he was there. I knew he was there. Okay. So this is going to give me two draws here. And I need these draws to be insane. I need these. And I can't use that next turn. Oh, that sucks. Uh, yeah, it's fine. Oh, no. Oh, no. Wait, wait, I can play this. So if I charge, if I charge this. I need to draw into another Golden Frieza. No! Oh, no! Hold on, hold on. Wait, 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 wait. Skill, 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 skill. This is actually so disappointing. Attack. I didn't get it? Oh, we lose here. One's in my drop. Oh, that's so unfortunate. That's fine. Oh, this sucks, man. And then they get to the draw here. A drop ghoul, though. Make it so they can't play this next turn. Uh, put you on the field. Put you on the field. Oh, we were so close, man. You know what I could have done? Well, no, this is not Frieza Clan. Yeah, that's just Frieza. All right, so this is what we can do. Hear me out. Hear me out. Now nah, we, we can't win this one. We cannot win. If I drop this, like if I attack with this, combo that, 
Like, he can just stop that with any card. This is a good, this is a great duel, by the way. This is a fantastic duel still. So, like, it's not, like, I don't regret it. Attack mode. Oh, my gosh. Oh, that sucks. Because if I switch this into attack mode, I can attack again. But I only have, I have to drop a card to do it. <laughs> no, <laughs> man. Oh, I needed to draw another strong Frieza card. They got it. They got it. They got it. They got it. That's fair. That's fair. That's fair. That, that was that was a fair play. That was a fair play. Damn. I want y'all to know, I think I have four Golden Freezes in this deck, too. Because of how important that is for, for, for late game. Sure, man. We'll combo my, my Zarbon. I don't know why I'm prolonging it. I don't know why I'm prolonging it. I should just let the beam go through. Oh. Where's my shore base, man? Because I definitely have four sh uh, uh, short bays and four of the... Um, oh, Ginyu, duh. For, I was I always said this, this is Vegeta card, but I didn't realize it was Ginyu. Yeah, that's it. That's a wrap. They got it. They got it. They, they got me. They got me. Yeah, you can have it, bro. That's all you. That's all you. You don't have to BM me, man. Just take the hit. Just take the hit. Why? Gobble. <laughs> Go to that Frieza! Oh my god. I needed that. That would have been it. It was one draw away and full power Frieza would have gotten me there. Hey, it's so much more fun when you're not playing against Green, Broly, Green Gohan. So I'm cool with that. All right, that's going to be it. Oh, if you guys want to see more Fusion World, just leave a like on the video. Again, this is card, card videos. They're always so... People either absolutely love card videos or they cannot stand it. It's the worst thing in the world. Let me know in the comments which side you're on because, uh, unfortunately, it's not for everybody. But it's a lot of fun. It's on PC, like I said. The the goal is they want to drop this on everything, kind of like how Yu-Gi-Oh! Master Duel is. It's a lot of fun. I just think it's just the game is just very unbalanced against Green. And if Green is the Broly and the Gohan and Android's deck, by the way, in case you're new. And it just makes the game not fun. But, hey, if you have any other decks to duel against, it's just so enjoyable. That's it. Hope you enjoyed. Two is up on the screen. I'll see you in the next upload.